What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy Arnie here. Hope you guys are doing well. So today's video is going to be more like a vlog. Um, I've got nothing planned really. I'm in town. So I thought I'd show you guys the shop and what I've been talking about and where I'm going to start making videos in the future. So yeah, I thought I'll show you guys the shop and just give you guys a short little tour of what I'm talking about. Let me just flip this camera around. So guys, this is the shop, basically, it's all the way around there, there's the parts room in there, the office is through there, uh, so basically we do work on any kind of model, the make or model car, so as you guys can see, there's a bit of everything in here, so we've got two, two, po two post oists, and yeah, uh, uh, there's some tools over there and whatnot, so yeah. So this is the engine bay, well the engine room, where we build most of our engines. Okay, why is the quality so bad today? Yeah, so. So yeah, this is the engine room. Let me just get some stabilization on this because I forgot my damn giblet and tripod today. So yeah, this video is going to suck pretty bad <laughs> without those to film. So yeah, this is the engine room where we build most of our engines, uh, do rebuilds and all of that. So, And also, this is where all my carburetor spares are, which I've been talking about in the last video. A bunch of different jets in here as well i see a lot of carburetor spares and jets and stuff these are for all types old carburetors which you don't get spares anymore there's a bunch of old carburetors laying down there so there's a bunch of parts in here guys uh, so yeah uh diesel testing machines toolboxes another toolbox more spares uh, old school wheel alignment uh, setup so basically for those of you who don't know about this you set these on each side of the car with one of those to measure the wheels and then <coughs> you look through this to there's a uh, like a triangle on the ground or uh, a 90 with a line so you center that line in the perfect position and you'll have your correct wheel alignment so that's a light tester. So this is basically the shop I've been talking about that I couldn't get to up until now. So yeah, uh, we even do trucks here and all of those stuff, of course. So let me go through here. We do old fashioned cars, rebuilds, restorations. We even work on tractors. Um, yeah most of these cars you guys haven't seen in other countries because yeah <laughs> this is an old parts car that i have left over for the bmw at home the 525 motorsport the track version like i said <laughs> we've got a, a milling machine oh shit the lightning is shit in this place so yeah let me get you here Also, and I want to put up this, this lifts in the future to work on, so. And here we got parts galore, guys. This is place is freaking crazy. It's just like parts everywhere. And it's just parts that we have extra. Like, this is crazy, guys. To think all of these parts. Look at all these old carburetors laying here. Down there, there's alternators, there's pulleys. Anything you can think of there is in this storeroom, so. <laughs> yeah. That, so, I hope you guys can see now why I want to do more videos here. Because everything is so accessible. It's better. That it's easier to work here because you have a bit of everything. Like these. These are even brand new pumps and brand new parts. Like, it's crazy, guys. Over there, we have brand new um, alternators and starters, and it just goes on and on, guys. Over here is a bunch of intake manifolds and stuff that were replaced, but they're still usable. They're still good. There's even a head down there that works still fine. 
Hey guys, this place is crazy, like. Tronic probes, look at what? Brand new stuff, like, just laying around. Filters, you can, <laughs> it's crazy, guys. So yeah, guys, this, the workshop is actually very empty right now because of the coronavirus and stuff. We moved out a lot of cars and finished a lot of cars and we haven't been taking on a lot of work. So yeah, it's quite empty. This thing is normally packed. You can you can barely walk between the cars. So yeah, this is basically uh, we got our bench system here, whatever you want to call it. Some more tools. This is truck tools, like big wrenches and stuff for trucks and trestles and bunch of jack stands. This is a special tool that we made to hold up the engine in the car while you take out the mountings at the bottom. So, a hydraulic press, a stand, standing drill. This is like our fab station. Uh, benches, which is really dirty right now for some reason. Uh, CO2 gas, oh, brazing gas, and another bench. So, yeah. This is basically why I wanted to show you guys just to see what is up and all of that I think it's a fun little video just to make with you guys and show you guys where I used to work well where I work and what I do we've got uh, I don't know if you guys can see that we've got a big compressor there next to the wall uh, come on this camera is terrible today um, yeah guys so normally this whole space is filled with our cars like uh, this whole up until from there straight through to that wall is filled with our cars because we got like 15 cars guys <laughs> so we filled this place up pretty good um, but yeah I thought oh well, guys I thought this was just a nice little video to make and to show you guys what is up and where I used to work and or where I work and what this place is all about so I hope you enjoyed please like and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next one peace I'm out Yo, this is